All right, uh, welcome back. So I took a few minutes to get the two people that have been causing me the most grief right now uh, into a bed. Surprisingly, we have been dealing with a lot of bad luck with the, uh, the infection rates, I guess, or the immunity rates not being as high as they should, probably. Um, I'm almost, like, I don't think two of these work. Like, I don't think you can stack stack it. Increases medical 10 quality, surgery success rate, and immunity gain speed when placed directly adjacent to a hospital bed. Only works for hospital beds. Normal beds will not benefit. Attaching more than one vital monitor to the same bed will have no effect. Okay. So, what does that mean, I guess? Okay. So, it the wiki says that it should work diagonally. So this should count. So we don't need to make a, a separate one or a second one there. I mean, we're basically doing everything we can. So I guess we just kind of have to hope for the best at the moment. just keep this focused as soon as there's a 10 quality that we or 10 did uh come up i guess we just got to take it i don't think we have the, the ability to get a second leg all right like i'm pretty sure that's it's too expensive to do. Yeah, we don't have the plat steel or the advanced components for it in any reasonable time. So this is going to be a little slow, unfortunately. I'm sorry, but I kind of have to prioritize making sure these guys don't die. So I think like as soon as one of these comes up, we will No. Stay in bed. Don't care if you don't have a shirt. Draft. Prioritize tending. Okay. Stay drafted. So you're going to immediately help out KD. Yeah, I really wish that we had some better medicine, but of course, our guys use the better medicine on dumb things rather than on important stuff like this. Alright, undraft. Prioritize tending. God, this sucks. Yeah, I really wish this wasn't as monotonous as it is. There's not much I can do, though. If it seems... Like, it feels like we should be much higher, moving a lot faster than this. Okay, we got 11 hours on that one, and 13 on this one. Okay, that's fine. I don't care. A little bit of fire is not a big deal. 
especially not on our outpost. Okay. Um. Yeah, I just stay in bed and hope for the best at this point. We're like four percent behind on on this. It's really annoying. Okay, we're about 3%, 3 to 2% behind, that's good, we're, we're improving. Alright, I think we're almost there, almost past the, uh, the risk point, it's gonna be really close. Yes, I know it's a medical emergency. I've been keeping an eye on it. It would be nice if it would show, like, hey, the immunity is getting above. Okay, it's barely below it right now. I think, I think she'll be fine, especially after the three uh, the three hours is up hopefully we can still get one more tend in before that happens okay we just surpassed it how are you doing you're pretty close as well okay this might be the one <laughs> i'm probably going to save as soon as these two are safe okay good good Uh, why is to have you draft and come back over here? Get ready to tend. I just do not want to risk losing these two. How are the other guys doing at this point? That's a lot closer than I've was really hoping for health what what's the okay you're seven hours not sure we're going to be able to get another tend in before that happens all right wise undraft prioritize tending Okay, you can stay drafted because you're going to need to stay in this room. That's way closer than what I really wanted. I think it'll be fine. Our, once the hour's up, we'll be able to get one more tend in, and that should be enough to prevent this from, from going sideways. Wise, undraft. Prioritize tending. Tola. Okay. That is very slow. I'm not a huge fan of that, but you are just slightly above. Okay. Walls is safe. Seventy percent ten quality. That's pretty good, honestly. Three hours. Yeah, we'll be able to get one more in with you, which we will probably want because that's very close. It's very. It's a little too close for comfort. Oh, come on. I really wish it would show the actual point per whatever percent. The immunity seems to be just 
a couple points off or ahead of the blue. Oh, man. Okay, cool. I'll whatever. Um, I believe the IEDs is probably the next one to do at this point. Um, all right, four. Okay, you're ever so slightly above. Nine hours, you're not gonna, it's not, you're not gonna be able to get anything in the next nine hours. God, this is so tense. It feels like it's going very slowly, and I'm sure it feels that way because it's so... Oh, um, why is you need the... Nag? No. Nag's too far away. We're, we need to uh, do this now. Okay. That should give just enough. Seems like Tola is just a point one percent ahead. Okay. Katie's just a little under a point one uh percent ahead. I think it'll be fine though. <laughs> I feel, I feel like I'm on one of those uh, doctor shows. Like, uh, Grey's Anatomy type of shows. Alright, KD is safe. Still ever so slightly above, which is good. We're about a point and one percent ahead. Katie or Kimmy, right? Um. Uh, let's see. Let's go ahead and get your bed moved over. Same with uh, I believe it's Wilkerson's. Keep an eye on Tola here. Her heat wave is over. Cool. Just ever so slightly ahead. Huh. I don't care. I think we'll be fine. Okay. I, I'm taking a save right now. Because I do not want to risk something else happening and then getting forced to uh, set back to before our guys were <laughs> healthy. Oh, man, that was stressful. But we did manage to save everyone. Everyone is immune to whatever they were dealing with. And yeah, cool. Okay, this can get taken out finally. Um, Kimmy, I don't think you can do this. Yeah, that's what I figured. Our food has definitely taken a bit of a hit because of that. Uh, KD being out. Uh, as well as Mason for a bit, uh, definitely hurt a lot. I guess I'll put Marco back on. On 
guessing you're just picking stuff up, which is fine. You need it, I suppose. Okay. Um, it would be nice if someone could go and pick up those components. And it, oh, these are forbidden for some reason. Prioritize hauling those in so they aren't uh, rotting away. Same with you, although these probably aren't uh, going away quite as quickly since they're not in running water. Got some light leather over here. That was quick. Um, I guess multi... Uh, I don't know. Bison. Okay. Interesting. How are we doing on, like, raw food? I think raw food-wise, we're okay. More of this stuff? How much got, uh... Got ruined. Okay. Now, at least most of the stress is gone. But yeah, that was definitely not the most enjoyable uh, experience, that's for sure. But we did manage to pull out ahead eventually and save all the people that were uh, being affected. Seems like dirty cooking area hasn't happened as much. So I'm guessing it was because I had the butcher table in here rather than elsewhere. So. It's definitely a good I a good choice too. Oh, our muffalo. Well, that's not good. Hopefully they survive. Cause I would actually prefer not to lose the muffalo. Muffaloes are actually, you know, helpful. <laughs> Um, I'm going to copy the settings and then just make another stockpile in here for mechanoid. Oh, shoot. Copy here. Paste here. And then delete. That way they're not running back and forth. Again, the smaller the base that you can have, the better. It means less stuff that you have to worry about. Uh, people um, having to run back and forth for. Got a lot of random leathers and things that we kind of need to get rid of. Prioritize cutting all this. I do want you to get... Yeah, because Walls has been out for quite a while, uh, our food production has been taking a bit of a hit as well. Can you just do all of this, please? What what are What is so important that you need to go over here for? No, that is not important. Prioritize cutting first. It's unfortunate that you don't even get anything back. I suppose it makes sense. It is a blight, but still. Okay, great. I'm, I'm really happy that you're prioritizing this one tree over here. 
rather than our actual food supply. But okay. Okay. Sure. Yep. Seems very important. tree hugger. Well, actually, no. She's not a tree hugger because she's <laughs> cutting down the trees. Okay. Um. Yeah, we are definitely hurting on food. We're gonna need to... We're probably gonna need to do some hunting, actually. Wildlife. I know there was a bunch of deer around. So let's go ahead and prioritize getting that. Let's see if we can get a second or a third muffalo. Uh, let's see. Um, no, Wilkerson, you stay off. I'm gonna just kind of turn up couple people that way we can try and get enough uh, venison to uh, keep ourselves afloat here Yeah, uh, medical emergency is definitely the uh, the theme of the episode, that's for sure. Cargo pods. Of course, they're on this map. Alpaca wool. Eh. I mean, I already have alpacas. I'm not sure we really need more alpaca wool, to be completely honest. Go ahead and build that one there and deconstruct this. Uh, let's see here. Eclipse, cool. It's honestly, of all the things, it's probably one of the less irritating ones. It's not ideal because a lot of our power comes from solar power, but... We do have some reserves if we need it. Honestly, we might want to just flip it on anyways. Keep uh, keep things running while this is... Come on. You know, you both were in that... In those beds together. Um, Kitty, where are you at? Come on, knock him out before he... Stop with the damn insulting. Because <laughs> I'm trying to minimize the amount of irritation these idiots keep trying to do. Of course, he gets, you know, four insults in somehow. Uh, could one of you maybe help him? I don't know what the uh, final straw was on that one, but it was probably for a stupid reason. If I, if I had to take a wild shot in the dark on that. Alright, how are you doing, buddy? You, uh... Okay, you'll be fine. The immunity is that high, they're usually fine. Go ahead and allow that again. Um, okay, cool. We are getting a couple deer. Prioritize removing that, please.
unfortunately, I believe that is only like what half of them, probably. Right, I completely forgot about this. Where is this at? Is it one of those ones that I have to accept the quest first? Prime Counselor of Leia has sent us a message. Oh, this is Leia. Oh, okay. That honestly, we might have to take it just to get this boost. Apparently pirates based in a nearby camp have been raiding the caravans. The camp is controlled by the Hammer Lobsters. Renzo is asking us to destroy the camp, which means eliminating the all pirates and turrets. Renzo says that there's a bandit camp at the site guarded by 10 pirates. Okay. What is this? That's lovely. Okay. Um, Bandit Outpost. I'm not sure if this means that the quest offer expires in that time or if the quest itself expires in that time. I'm not sure, but I think we do need to accept. Expires in 21 days, okay. All right, where is this at? Okay, honestly, that's not too far away, all things considered. So I think that's gonna have to be in the next part though. Um, I think uh, we will go ahead and at least get that part done. Go ahead, place that one down, and then ship wise, let's see. Okay, sorry about that. Um, do something kind of like that. Got two, one, okay, so that one right there should be fine. Do you want to kind of take care of this? Can I just remove this and it'd be fine? Can I just do that, please? Probably not. We're probably going to have to build this one first. Deconstruct. This might cause a cave in right here, but okay, it's fine. Cool. Um, let's go ahead build that. Ship wise, I. I think we still need a ship computer. I don't know why it needs to not be placed under a roof. Seems a little silly. Right, let's do something kind of like that.
All right, I'm just trying to kind of get some stuff set up. Great. I, I love when it decides, you know, to just do one single thing rather than just doing all of it. <sighs> okay. At least that there. So, all right. I think I'm going to put a cut in here. And in the next part, uh, I guess we'll try and do that quest. Uh, that way we can get a bunch of favor with Leia so we can actually, you know, do the frickin' mission. Or get the, uh, the Persona Core that we definitely, desperately need. Um, so, alright, thank you for watching, and I will see you guys next time.